So Xiaomi has released another OTA update for Mi A1 this month. And in this video, I will be testing its features and updating my Mi A1 to latest security patch that is March. So before we start, I'm your host Amy and you're watching Android Power. The size of the update is 440 MB and if you guys still not getting this update, just go to the settings, then go to Google, then scroll down and tap on security, then tap on 3 dot menu and tap on help and feedback, then again tap on 3 dot menu and check view in Google Play Store and you will see carrier services, just scroll down and become the beta tester of this app. And it will take some time to become a beta tester of this app. Now again go to the settings and go to the system update and check if there is an update. Now the update size is 440 MB. But sadly in this update we are not getting Android 8.1 Oreo. It's still on Android 8.0 Oreo but the update size is 440 MB. Looks like Xiaomi is fixing some bugs with this update. Also, it improves the stability and performance of your Mi A1 with this latest security patch. So let's update our Mi A1 and check if the update is as good as they have said. So the initial booting process has done and our Mi A1 has updated to March security patch. So there is no new things UI wise and if we go to the settings, there are new new options like double tap to wake up or new other tweaks. And if you guys have bored from this talk old UI and white theme, you can change the themes in Mi A1 without rule. I will leave a link in the description below of the video. Let me change the theme. Now guys, let's talk about the update. It's still on Android 8.0 with the security patch of March 2018 with the build number of 9.5.9.0. And now it's time to test its feature. So start with the fingerprint. So I am adding my fingerprint. The fingerprint is working flawlessly like other previous updates. But there is a one second delay when you unlock your phone with your fingerprint. Looks like Xiaomi haven't improved this. And if we talk about the camera, the camera shutter lag has now gone with this update and it's taking great pictures without any lag. And if we talk about the portrait mode, the portrait mode working fine with this update. The another new thing I have found, the missed call and outgoing calls are shown separately. The dialer app opens up a fast and there is no lag at all. The network is working fine and VOLT is working fine with Geo 4G. And the screen lights up instantly if you receive a call. And, we and if we talk about the charging, there is no increase in the speed of the charging. Even I have tested with my OnePlus 5T charger, it's charging normally with 5V 2 amps. And can't comment on battery life as of now, I need to test it, but it looks good. The Antutu benchmark score is 77,039. It is few more points greater than the previous build. For me, the ROM feels super fine and fast. There is no lag at all and I haven't find any issues. So do update your phone and if you face any issues let me know in the comment section below. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Till then I am signing off. Bye bye.